Welcome to this DEF podcast. And our guest today is the professor of national security studies, John Denny, at the Strategic Studies Institute. It's become clear to us at the Army War College and at the SSI that energy security is a compelling national security issue for the United States. If you examine just the changes over the last 10 years in terms of global energy supply, as well as the changes in global energy demand, new players on the stage, etc., this was a pretty compelling issue for us to take on. So we were interested in trying to gather some thought leaders, experts in the field, and to examine changes both on the supply and the consumption side of this equation. And then, in turn, the military implications, the so what for the military and the Army. The energy that is used at, at Army, Navy, and Air Force installations and our forward operating bases, uh, but also the energy used to conduct, train for, and return from operational missions. There also seems to be a fairly uh, profound implication for the military in terms of the future mission set. For example, the new energy flows in terms of how energy trade is conducted has an implication or has implications for where and how our military may be used overseas to try to safeguard those transit routes. And so it seems to us that uh, some of the takeaways are uh, fairly important for the future of the military, especially in a post-ISAF environment in which we face the prospect of a downsized military and budget austerity. And so we're trying to get our arms around what those implications are and how they'll affect the military are very important. Our guest today has been the Professor of National Security Studies, John Denny, uh, at the Strategic Studies Institute of the Army War College.